welcome back to my channel. Um, so today is a little like a vlog day again because it's Friday. Um, but yeah, so right now I have a couple things planned. Um, so I'm first um, gonna go pick up. I finally got a ring light. Yay! Um, at Best Buy. Um, I'm gonna do like curbside pickup so I don't have to like go in the store or anything. Um, I've been in Best Buys too much now um, because with all my like phone stuff. So I just did like curbside pickup. Um, and one in my area and so I'm just gonna go there um, and I'm gonna pick up my ring light and I'll show it to you guys and then um, I'm gonna go to this store we have here um, I don't know if it's anywhere else um, called five below and um, I'm gonna do some really cute like t-shirt designs um, so I saw like a couple t-shirts there I think they range from like three to five dollars and I was in there a couple days ago and they actually have some like pretty decently cute t-shirts um, so I'm gonna make them even cuter and do like cute designs and like show you guys so it's gonna be like a little like DIY t-shirt thing um, and then also kind of like a little drive with me and picking up my Best Buy ring light and stuff so yeah we're gonna do that today <laughs> Um, but first we are gonna go to Duncan and get some coffee. Um, so let's go. Made it to Duncan. In the line at Duncan. Okay, so I just got my drink at Duncan. I got um, I'm gonna shout out actually another youtuber here. Um, her name's Courtney Bond. Um, I saw her Duncan secret menu and this is the upside down ice caramel macchiato. So I'm gonna try it. Oh, tastes like there's like ice cream at the bottom or something like this probably just like vanilla flavoring or there was a guy looking at me <laughs> um, it's good but like it barely tastes like coffee I wonder if they just gave me a regular ice caramel macchiato because in the video hers was like they mixed the two layers together so that it wouldn't be like so like bitter like coffee kind of taste and it like would mix with the sweet so I wonder if they maybe just gave me a regular ice caramel macchiato this is supposed to be the upside down ice caramel macchiato but the bottom's pretty good so that's good um so our Duncan run is done um so now we're gonna go to Best Buy sorry for my face it's summer and the masks are like killing my like face because it's like sweaty and hot but you gotta wear your masks to stay safe stay safe wow so um yeah I'm getting a lot of like pimples down here because the masks and sweat are just not mixing good and it has been like 90 degrees all week here and so hot but like that can't stop you from wearing your mask because you have to wear your mask um, and I'm also excited because this is the first time I got Duncan this is like sad well, not actually sad, but like this is the first time I think I've gotten it with, I haven't gotten Duncan in like five days ish. And last week and the week before, I think I was getting like Duncan like every like couple days because I just like kept trying new things and doing different things. But this week you weren't supposed to spend money. Um, it was like the blackout for the Black Lives Matter um, movement and you weren't supposed to spend money from the 4th to the 7th. So I hope y'all didn't spend money from the 4th to the 7th online or in store or anything like that unless it was a black owned business. Um, but you weren't supposed to spend money from the 4th to the 7th, which is today is the 8th now. So um, now I got my Duncan and I can like spend money again and feel safe about it. But like I truly didn't like eat out, get anything, spend money at the store or anything. Um, so I yeah I hope you guys did that too um, but I'm excited that I got Duncan again and I hope the like not spending money thing was like beneficial for the Black Lives Matter and everything like that and yeah so um, off to Best Buy we go okay guys I figured out a tip for this because I don't think they gave me the upside down one I think they just gave me like a regular ice camel macchiato but if you like put your straw down the bottom <laughs> and then move it to on top then you get both tastes and it's like the coffee kind of bitter kind of taste because it's like black. I think it's like black coffee because it tastes like really bitter and then like move it down to the sweet part I can't do it when I'm recording but like I've been doing it because the top part is really bitter and the bottom part is like really sweet so they would taste good mixed together if I actually got the upside down one um, but yeah I've just been like <laughs> Okay guys, we made it to Best Buy. Okay, so we made it to Best Buy. I'm waiting in my car first because you have to say on the app that you're there um, for curbside pickup. So I'm gonna see how all that works because at the Best Buy, 
that I normally see. Um, there's like spots that you have to like park in if you're doing curbside. So let me see and then I'll show you guys once I get my ring light. Guys, I just got it. Guys at Best Buy were so nice. I only had to wait like a couple minutes and it's here. I'll show you guys more of it later when I get home and when I do like the DIY t-shirts, I'll film with my new, what's it called? Ring light. <laughs> okay, I'm headed to five below now. Okay guys, so I made it to five below, but first I'm gonna Lysol off, Lysol off this. I already did the front side, but I'm just gonna show you guys cause you gotta be safe. So I'm gonna Lysol off my Lysol. Wow, why can't I even say that word today? Off um, the ring light. And then um, I'm kind of just gonna let you guys know what's like going on here. Yes, I have one glove to go in the store with and then I'm gonna get my mask. Um, so I'm gonna film two videos concurrently, co-currently, if that's a word, um, at the same time, if that's even a word, concurrently, um, I think it is though, I'm gonna look it up, um, but yeah, I'm gonna film two videos at the same time, um, when I'm in five below, but like, you won't see them at the same time, you'll see them in two separate videos, but like, for this one, I'm gonna like, get the t-shirt, show you guys the different t-shirt options they have, and then after, um, it's gonna be like, really quick inside the store, like what I film, and then, um, I'll show you like, the actual part of the video is like, the DIY, like, t-shirts after, and like, different like, cuts and designs, and like, different things like that um so i'm not going to show too much in this store because i'm only going to pick out like a couple t-shirts probably not more than five to like try this out with and then at the same time i'm going to be filming um a like college dorm shopping for like a budget like under a budget or like for a good amount of price um and i'm going to get a couple things for like college like my college dorm and stuff because they have like really cute stuff here and i want to get it before they run out of like the cute stuff that they have that I like because I don't want to like get it in like August or whatever and have it get too late so yes I'm gonna do that um but yeah I'm just gonna let you guys know that I'm gonna be filming like two videos at the same time so if I'm like in the same outfit wearing the same thing doing the same thing that is why but yeah let's go and find below and find some cute shirts I also just realized my phone is at 13% so I got a video quick and I got to drink the rest of my Duncan or else it's gonna be all watery by the time I come out but yeah, now I'm going into Five Below. Okay, I am in Five Below. There's copyrighted music, but I'm gonna go show you guys the t-shirts. Okay, I am done at five below. I got my shirts and then stuff for the other video that you kind of see in the back, but it's for the other video that's coming up. Um, why do I still have this on? Okay, um, I was gonna go into Ulta and get like a tinted moisturizer thing because I kind of want to think that's not a foundation, but it still like can cover, but it's starting to rain. So I don't know, probably not, <laughs> but then I'll see you guys at home for my DIY t-shirts. Uh, it's literally like pouring now and I was just gonna go into Alta because it's right next to five below <clears throat> like look okay if you can hear it out there I realize it's not worth it to go into Alta to get my tinted moisturizer I don't know I kind of want to go though but it's like pouring you can hear it <laughs> um oh the guy in front of me just pulled up so then I'd be one spot closer should I do it? I wish I could do videos live. Be like, guys, comment if I should go or vote on my poll. <laughs> um, sorry if the rain's loud, but yeah, mm, I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I feel like it was a sign that the guy in front of me just pulled away. So I feel like I should run into Ulta, but it's pouring. Um, I don't know how wet I'm going to get. Good thing my hair is not like done or anything, my makeup. Good thing I never do that because then I never get mad when I like um get wet in the rain or something happens or whatever but I don't know should I go Ugh. I feel like if it slows down I'll go guys I did it and I forgot my mask and my gloves in the car so now I have to freaking run back in the rain <laughs> okay I was gonna go in because if your girl is willingly gonna go into Ulta 
can't pass up that opportunity because I never go into Ulta or like makeup stores or buy makeup but I feel like this was a bad sign because I forgot my mask and my gloves and I'm soaked for no reason Woo! okay now I'm gonna go to the DIY t-shirts I'm just not gonna go I'll go another day it's fine I'm fine I'm fine I'm dead right after I filmed this my Apple watch reminded me to breathe <laughs> I could tell okay guys so I am back inside mostly dry um so I know this is kind of like a weird angle but this is how I'm gonna do like the t-shirt video um well like the t-shirt part of the video and I kind of want to just like unbox my ring light and see how I normally do lighting I normally just do this lamp um, like somewhere near me so it kind of like brightens up my face and then I normally just do like the light in my room um, I have like a light on the top of the ceiling that you guys have probably seen and then plus like the natural kind of light from outside even though it's kind of like dark and gloomy because it's raining so I kind of wanted to do like show this and then show um, the light from the ring light so I'm gonna unbox it now it's just kind of like a cheap um, I think it was it was like $39.99 um, but I will link it down below. It's from Best Buy in case any of you would like to buy it. If you don't have a ring light already or are looking for a new one, I'll let you know how it is. There it is. I'm not sure if it'll need to be like charged or anything right now. Um, like I don't know if it comes a little bit charged or if I'm gonna have to do that before I start using it for the video. But this is the light. And then this is the thingy that I put on it that holds my phone. And it's like adjustable. And then the little like tripod stand. Um, and it says it goes up to like 42 inches. Whoa. Yeah, look at that. I really was looking for a ring light for a long time because I wanted to get one that I could use like, like short on like my vanity or something if I'm doing like a makeup video, which I would basically never do um but if I was doing one for some reason or um and I wanted to get one where I could like stand up or like sit and it could be that height um so I'm really excited about this because it looks like it's kind of exactly what I wanted so um it's kind of unboxed like I pulled one leg out maybe I'll pull the rest out um but for right now I'm gonna just like set it right here so I can show you guys the t-shirts and everything and then I will get into the DIY t-shirts I picked out like four t-shirts and I have like four different designs in my mind so I will show you the designs um or like the cut out things that I want before I do them and then I'll show you my result and then I'll show you the t-shirts after so yeah okay so I kind of like unboxed it set it up a little more um so this is her this is the ring light um so you can like adjust like the legs and this kind of just like pushes into the phone holder part and then you can like tighten both which is like nice it was like a little flimsy at first and I was like oh god um but I plugged it in so let's turn it on whoa look at her she's bright okay so you can like decrease it that's nice and then you can increase it to where you're blinded so I would say so far, 10 out of 10. I'm gonna show you guys how it looks now if I have it in front of me instead of just like my natural light. Okay, wow, that is bright, but like I'm happy. I'm oily, like maybe I should start looking nicer if I'm gonna be using the ring light. Um, I'm gonna turn it down a few. Okay, I think that's good. Up one. Oh, it has like a different mode. It has like different light modes. It's like a off-white and then like a bluish kind of tint and then like a white i think i like the like whiter I'm turn it up okay i'm turning it down i think this is good so i'm going to turn off the other lights around me because now i don't need it okay so now i'm going to show you guys the t-shirts i got at five below um they're not like super cute t-shirts but like some of them I like what they say and then once they're like cropped and like cut cute like I think they'll look a lot cuter and these aren't for like super fancy wearing or anything they're kind of just if I want to wear like athletic shorts and like a t-shirt I got this idea because I wanted to crop one t-shirt that I don't think I've ever worn because it's kind of like a stiff kind of t-shirt so I'm gonna show that to you and maybe I'll do that one first um but yeah I now realize that maybe I should have done this video during pride month for June because it's a pride shirt um it's from my high school I've had it for like two years and like I only haven't worn it because it's like a very stiff t-shirt it was for like um a fundraiser and stuff but it has it's super cute pink has a little rainbow flag and then um, on the back it says I can't hate for long it isn't worth it 
So I thought that was really cute, um, but I obviously don't want to crop off this like quote, so I think I'm going to like crop it like to here or whatever. So yeah, this is the shirt that I've already had, and then I'm going to show you the ones I got from Five Below. Um, so I think I got larges in most of these, um, just so like they're a little like bigger when you like crop them and they're a little more like comfy and they're not so like stiff. Um, but I did think, I do think I got a medium in one of them. Um, so I got this, it says like New York Soho. And then I got this shirt. Oh my gosh. I'm so dumb. This shirt's already cropped and I can't, so, I mean, it's cute, but like I can't do anything with it now. It says, stay kind, but it's already cropped. I didn't even realize that. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> I hope the rest of these aren't. Okay, good. Um, so this one I thought was kind of like a cool design. I don't know if it's more like a guy design, but I think it would look cute if I like did a little something, something with it. Um, and then the last shirt, it just says be a nice human. But yeah, this is the last shirt. The largest are like fairly big, um, but that's okay because they'll be like comfy. So I'll show you my first design idea. Okay, so I was going to screen record because I have these ideas from Pinterest, but I think I'm just going to like put up a picture of what I want. Um, so the first shirt that I'm going to do is the like New York um, Soho one. Um, so I'm going, I've never been to New York, but yeah. Um, but I think I'm going to do this like thing where you got like a scoop neck and then I'm just going to like maybe cut off the sleeves a little bit so they're like a little like more like fringy um and like comfy instead of like so tight but yeah that is my first one so i'm gonna show how i do it and everything okay got my handy dandy scissors here and we're gonna just start cutting i haven't tried on these shirts and maybe i should try on these shirts before i actually crop them but we're just gonna go with it let's go <laughs> Okay, um, so for my first one, I'm just gonna do like a scoop neck and then I'm gonna try it on after and probably crop it too, um, but I'll see how low I wanna crop it. So for the first one, they said just to line this up on the floor. I'm gonna see if I'll have you guys see it too. Um, kind of, but I kinda just wanna get this t-shirt right. Um, so you'll just have to like line it up and make sure there's no like wrinkles or anything. And then there is a saying on this shirt, so I'm not gonna go too low, um, but I'll show you guys when it's finished. Okay, so the scoop on this one is done. I hope you guys could see me like doing it, but I'm not completely sure, but it kind of turned out well. Um, I'm just using like a pair of scissors um, and then I'm gonna try it on and see how much I wanna crop it, but I won't show you guys that part cause it's kind of boring, um, but I will show you all of them at the end. Okay, so the next t-shirt I'm gonna do is the Be A Nice Human one. Um, and this one I'm gonna do like kind of like a muscle tee, but then I'm gonna do it where I could like tie the shirt and have it actually be like set up and like designed where I could tie it um you just have to like cut off the back part of it but not the front in like a triangle um so I'll kind of show how I do it I think it's kind of difficult to show how I do it um but then I'll show you the end result as well Okay, so this one is done now too. I did like the sleeves and this, and you really can't see my vision until you see it on me. Um, so I'm gonna do like the rest of them and then you'll see them. Um, and then for this one, the like one that I found out is already cropped, I'm just gonna like leave it how it is because I think I was just gonna like crop it anyway. Um, so the job is already done for me. So I have two more left. Um, next, I'm gonna do this one because I don't wanna do like much to it because it does have like something on the back too. Um, so I think I'm just gonna like crop it just like the like stay kind one um so I'll, let me just go ahead and crop this and then i'll do my last one okay so i was drinking water and it spilled don't judge me but um this is the ending result of this one it's just like a crop um it is a little like messy like snippy so um i would like show it to you guys on me but then like actually when i wear it i might just like make it look like a little like neater and straighter because if you could see 
the lines are like a little jagged but they're not too bad so like i'm not super mad about it um so for this one is my last one. Oh, and also for that one like my scissors gave out on me like halfway um and so that's kind of why i had to like switch scissors and try because i was cutting through like the front and the back at the same time instead of like cutting through the front and then going around and cutting the back i would just like went for it but for this one i am gonna do a design um probably gonna crop it too that was kind of like the point of this to have like a couple like i wear like a lot of t-shirts and a lot of them are like either like larges so like they're a little big on me because i generally wear like mediums and t-shirts or they're just like heavy and i just wanted like a couple like light t-shirts wow you can see me in the mirror wow i still haven't hung that up i got it for my birthday um but yeah so i kind of wanted just a couple like crop tops to like have be a little like flowy and it's been like really hot this week and then obviously it's summer um so i wanted a couple like cute like crop top things that are just like regular like comfy t-shirts instead of like actual cute like shirts that are like a little more uncomfortable to wear um but i think for this one i'm gonna do a design where like you keep the top i'll put it right here like the picture of it where you like keep the up top but then like cut a little like v right here i think that would be kind of cute with this one because like the more i look at this t-shirt i kind of don't like it but like I got so many t-shirts with like sayings on it so I wanted one with just kind of like a design on it so I'm probably gonna crop this one too and then do that little like V thing if you guys know what I'm talking about but you will because there'll be a picture right here um but yeah so um I'm gonna do this one and that is my last one and then I'm gonna like show them all off to you guys I'm excited to try them on and see what they actually look like and see if I hate them or if they actually turned out like decently well so let's see okay so the last one is done you can kind of see it here but it'll probably show more when i try it on the little like cutout, and then i did end up cropping it too so i like it a little bit more now it looks a little cuter um so i'm gonna try them all on and see how you guys like them now um so yeah i'm gonna get them all together and then do a little like fashion show for you guys okay guys this is the first one I totally forgot that I was going to crop this one too, but now I'm not sure if I'm going to do it because like, I feel like this would look cute. Like if it was like tucked into something. Um, but this is the New York Soho one. This is the one that I did the scoop neck to. So. So yeah, this is the one that I did the scoop neck to. I like the scoop neck. I'm still deciding. Um, I might crop it. I might not on my own after this video, but yeah. This is the first one. Okay guys, and this is the second shirt. This is the one that was already cropped that I bought that I didn't know was cropped. This is what I was gonna do to it anyway. Um, so cute, cute, stay kind. Okay guys, so here is the next one. I really like this shirt a lot more now that I like did a little something to it. So for this one, I um, just like cropped it yet again. And then I did the little like scoop neck thing and I kind of think I wanted like a V kind of thing, but I think maybe the curve was better for this like type of shirt since like the squares start here. So it might look weird if I did a V. So I kind of like it. Um, it looks a little choppy, so maybe I'll like go over it. And I have a necklace on, so now you can like see the necklace through this instead of just putting it over my shirt but I guess I could put it over too and it could like sit in there nicely um but yeah for this one I just like cropped it um pretty cute um yeah I like it a little bit more now than I originally did um I feel like the rose is really pretty um but it kind of like is like a skater shirt like I should wear some like vans with this or something um but yeah this one is cute too um and I especially like it just with like the little extra pizzazz so on to the next one okay so this is the next t-shirt so this is the t-shirt that I didn't buy from five below that I already had and that kind of gave me the idea for the video because I wanted to crop this one um so I do like the crop that I did for this one didn't cut off the quote in the back or anything I feel like maybe it's just the shirt though like you ever have those shirts that aren't like comfy fabric and they're just kind of like stiff so like maybe I'll crop the arms or something um I don't really know but yeah um i hope you guys like this one i like this shirt um just in general oh shoot i think it's is it like this <laughs> i don't know like i didn't measure or line up anything i kind of just like did it on a whim and just like cut things and did this but like i feel like this is kind of cute right like i like it like i'm kind of like a fan um this one's cute but maybe i'll do something with like the neck or the sleeves to make it a little bit more comfy 
Okay, so I think this is my favorite so far. Um, I wish I would have bought a medium in this because this is a large and it's a little like poofy, but I guess it's what I wanted, like comfy shirts, um, so it's not so like tight. But also look at my sign. Thank you. Um, but yeah, I like this because it's like a muscle tee, but I cut it to where like it's not all the way down like how some muscle tees are. Ooh, gotta get that. <laughs> I like left a piece of fabric out. But yeah, I like where like muscle tees aren't all the way down. They're just like a little bit here. So you could like see the cute bra you're wearing, but like not too much, you know? Um, so yeah, I actually really like this one. I like the saying. Um, I actually saw on the like design I was following that they did like crop the neck. So maybe I will do that um, like some other time. But like, I feel like this is kind of cute how it is right now. Maybe I'll keep the neck. Maybe I'll cut it. Um, I feel like I did like three scoop necks, so that would be a little like the same kind of thing in the video. But I like how this just like ties so like naturally because I cut the like two things right here. So then you just like tie it up and that's how the shirt will go instead of like figuring out how to tie it or tying it with a hairband or something like that. So that is like really easy. This is cute. Maybe I will wear this shirt for the rest of the day because I kind of like it with the shorts and stuff. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm going to come here now. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, thank you for like coming along with me from like my adventures to Duncan to Five Below to Ulta. Well, almost Ulta, not really Ulta. And Best Buy. I forgot to say Best Buy. Um, and then back home and then just designing the t-shirts. I hope you liked it and got some like cute tips and everything um and hopefully you will like design a t-shirt i think these are a little uneven mm. i didn't measure things and i probably should have um but i hope this gives you ideas if you want to like crop some t-shirts that you have and like if they're old t-shirts just like making them new um and everything like that so yeah um i hope you guys have a great day i hope you enjoyed this video be a nice human and i will see you in the next video bye